Hi everyone, Peter Andre here. Thank you for coming back to my YouTube channel. Uh, a lot of you responded very well to last week's 10 minute hip workout. Uh, and it means a lot to me because I'm asking you guys to ask me questions, anything that you need. The only question I actually got last week was what app do I use for my timer? I use something called Tabata. And it's an app where you can set how many seconds rest, how many seconds preparation, uh, how many cycles you want. It's really good, So, but you can use anything. Now, this week, and at the moment, I am doing just 10 minute workouts. And the reason I'm doing that is because there's a lot of people that are saying to me that they've never really worked out before, or they've worked out but they want to get back into it. So I don't want to hit you guys with 15, 20, 30 minute exercises. I don't want to go into all the weight stuff yet. That's coming. But because the gyms have opened, again, thankfully, I thought if some of you are going to the gym and you want a quick sort of get back into it circuit hit training, uh, you can do it at the gym. If you haven't got that, you can find alternatives. So for example, what I'm going to be using today is Bowflex dumbbells, right? Which have different variations of uh, weights that you can use. But if you haven't got that, go old fashioned, get a sack of potatoes or get, you know, some water bottles or something that's a bit heavier, you know, whatever works for you. So today we're going to be doing a fat burning 10 minute circuit train. I'm going to use some equipment for those that are at the gym or have got some equipment at home. And then I'm also gonna show you stuff that you can do if you haven't got that equipment. Remember, just find alternatives that work for you. So while I'm explaining this all to you guys, just start sort of just loosening up a bit, jogging on the spot. Eight different exercises, one of them you're repeating twice. First thing you're gonna do is butt kicks. Butt kicks are easy, just basically kick your butt. It's an alternative to people who don't wanna lift their knees really high, but you don't wanna just be sort of doing this, you know. So we're gonna do 30 seconds of butt kicks, then we're gonna do 30 seconds of incline abs. Again, if you don't have a bench, you can lie on the floor. Keep jogging on the spot right now, just to warm yourself up. Um, then we're gonna do lower back. I'm gonna use one of these balls here, but if you don't have that, just lie on the floor and try and lift your legs up on the back. Can be quite difficult, but you can do this. So what we'll do, uh, with these weights, we're just going to do some bicep curls. You can do them as hammer curls, long, the long muscle, or you can just do them as bicep curls. So that'll be for 30 seconds. When we finish that, we're going to hold the weight here. We're going to do squats for 30 seconds. When we finish that, we're going to do one more shoulder, which is sides. And this one is going to hurt. Come over here. Find yourself a wall. Everyone's got a wall. Put your back against the wall and sit. 30 seconds. This is really, really good for your legs, for your core. 30 seconds, you sit there. And then when we finish, we do another 30 seconds of butt kicks and that's the first cycle. Are you ready and do you feel warmed up? Let's go. All right guys, whatever you've got, I've got an Apple Watch, I'm gonna put it on high intensity, you can put it on other. Um, so get that ready. Make sure you've got your timer ready, which is my Tabata, remember, uh, eight 30 second exercises in a row, one minute break. We do that again twice, that's all you gotta do. So you're ready, here we go. I'm gonna put my high intensity on. We've got 10 second preparation. Session. Now just follow me, remember the first thing is butt kicks. Uh, you're gonna wanna turn to your side. Uh, sorry, you don't have to turn to your side. I'm gonna turn to my side so you can see it. Very simple, just butt kicks, just kick your butt. Work. Now, if you find that this is gonna to be too much for you, which I hope it isn't, then you can just jog on the spot really slow. But I don't want you to do that. I want you to do the butt kicks. Okay, it's only 10 seconds to go. We're gonna go straight into abs. If you can't do the one I'm doing, do the alternative. But always protect your back, always. Right. Work. Straight into abs. Remember, breathe, breathe, and feel that tense down the bottom. Feel that tense. Do the alternative if you want. Try and keep your legs as straight as possible, if that's possible. Straight into lower back. Right? Straight into lower back. This is excellent, tenses your lower back. Remember, you've got the alternative if you can't do this. This is the third exercise already. There's only eight. Keep 
you should be Get One. your bicep curls, however you want to do it. Make sure your form is okay. Now, if you don't want to do bicep curls, you can do them as hammer curls, just by turning it that way. Again, if you haven't got weights, do it without weights, but tense. Make sure you tense when you do it, okay? Tense at the top, tense down the bottom. Tense at the top, tense down the bottom. When you finish, put them up here and do squats. Okay, if you find that you don't want to do it with weights, put the weights down and do them. Now, the alternative is sumo squats, which is your legs wide apart, and that's that one, which are good. But there's nothing like sitting back and doing squats. Tense as well when you come up. That's that one. Work. Do your shoulder again, I'm gonna check the form. Now, if you don't wanna do it with weights, don't do it with weights, but make sure you tense. Okay, tense. And you can do a straight arm as well. Tense, tense. Straight arm, but better with weights obviously if you can. Come over here, we're going to the wall here. Sit against the wall, feet flat, planted in the ground, your ass level, as 90 degrees as you can get, and just sit there. It's only 15 seconds to go. We're gonna finish off with butt kicks, then we get a minute break and repeat that. That's it. You can do this, I know you can. Five, four, three, two, one, and then butt kicks One. to finish. Again, jog on the spot if you feel that you don't want to do that. Of course, you can do star jumps instead, but let's not. Let's just stick to what we're doing. So, in 10 seconds, your heart rate should be up. Five, four, three, two, one. You've got a minute break now. One. So. Starting session. Got a minute, heart rate at 160. 165 actually. So that should uh, get your heart rate up. Got a minute break guys. Then we're gonna do it one more time. And that's it. Yeah, they're intense, but these are great 10 minute fat burners. Even if you do it at the end of the day, or do it at the very start of your day, get it out of the way. Grab a coffee, literally, you can grab a coffee and do it in between your coffee sips. Gives you energy, or have a coffee and wait 20 minutes, you'll be raging. Raging in Australia means pumped. I'm a bit out of breath, but it's good. Heart rate's going down now. We, we've got 10 seconds left. Nine. Session. Right, so we're gonna go again. Butt kicks, last round. Here we go, butt kicks. Again, do what works for you. After this, we're gonna go to abs. Woo. My butt kicks. Rather than getting my butt kicked, I like to kick my own. Straight into abs. Straight into abs. Work. Remember, try and get your legs straight. Try and keep both hands there. You can always be cheeky and go to the side, down to the side. We're going lower back. Lower back, guys. Work. Woo! Half the fun is trying to do it all on time. Lower back. Remember the alternative. You've always got the alternative. And even if you don't have one of these, push it out of the way. And you can just do that. 
Try not to break things as you're doing it. But that's also another alternative. Straight to biceps. Work. Again, remember, form, tense up, tense down. If you haven't got weight, do it without, but tense. The other alternative, don't forget, hammer curls, right? Guys, I'm 47, I can do this. You can definitely do this. Just do it at your own pace. Now, we're gonna go into squat, remember, you can either have the weights, or you do not have to have the weights. And you can go normal squat, or you can go sumo squat. Okay? Again, no weight. Sit back, straight up. Sit back, straight up. Sit back, straight up. I don't know if I got that right, but. Right, straight after that. Get these. We've only got three more exercises. Two, again. Make sure your form is okay. Tense. If you don't want to do these, do it without weights. Tense. Tense. Tense again. You can go straight arm, which is also very good, but I like slightly bent arm. Great for shoulders. Come over here. Remember, plant your feet to the floor. 90 degrees. If you've got a mirror, have a look somewhere. My oh, can't it's behind me. Stay there. 15 seconds, that's it. Butt kicks and then you're done. Butt kicks and then you are done. Nine, eight, seven. Heart rate 171, so really good for your heart rate. Ready? Butt kicks. That's it. And then you're done. Again, if you feel your heart rate's too high, slow down, there's no rush. Last few seconds, you can do this. You can do it. Done. You've got this one minute rest, use it to stretch, use it to cool down. There's many different stretches you can do. Just try and cool yourself down, okay? And that's it. I'll turn that off. Stopping session. Just try and stretch out if you can. Good one is. Maybe down. And then just drop it. That's it. Give yourselves a round of applause. That's a 10 minute fat burner. Go and get a drink. Like my friend Steve always says, if you like, press like. If you love it, subscribe. Uh, come back next week, guys. And next week, I'm going to be doing some cooking, showing you guys the type of food that I eat. I'll give you one of my special dishes that I love. And don't worry, it's not completely cut out of all the, you know, fun stuff. There's still fun stuff in there. See you next week.